about to head out on the water and uh, yesterday I told you guys we were gonna go to Sugar Lake well lied a little bit unfortunately we got word that there are currently two cartel groups that are fighting it out of Sugar Lake so we don't want to be anywhere near that for our safety and our friends here for their safety as well so we're heading back to Lake El Cuchillo yesterday was an interesting day it was tough in the beginning but at the end we caught two really nice fish and uh, hoping fingers crossed someone catches a 10 pounder I got one right here. here. Yep. That was quick. That was quick. Is that first case? Uh. Not close to first case, kind of close. No, my Senko. <laughs> I only got a couple of them. Do you? Yeah. Dude, I cooked that guy good. Chew, you got some Senkos? Uh, all right. See you, buddy. <laughs> yeah, they're, both. they're all in the other boat? Well, we it's all good. Now I got a couple more. Yeah. I'm not going to mess around. You guys caught your Giants both on Senkos, right? Yeah. I'm just going to fish all day with one. Well, Chase that 10-pounder. Oh, that's definitely there. a peric lens. Ooh. <laughs> Enjoy that view, guys. Oh! oh. Alright. It's popping over oh, here. He's in popper? Good. Nice. Yeah, that's good. Come on. Oh yeah, there you go, man. Oh, that one. Solid one. We've caught like six fish today. Something like that. Yeah. Six fish in the first hour. Well, yesterday we caught like five fish in five hours. It looks like they're biting better today, huh? Yeah. These are nice spots. Good for numbers? Yeah. Come on. I saw that line jump. Yep. Oh, it's a good one. That's a good fish. I saw that line jump. Rob just caught his fish. Yeah, we'll net it. Why not? Just to play it safe. Because I need to land one good fish, right? Let's take that one. Woo! <laughs> Starting the morning off. Beautiful one, the Senko. We've got, I think that's a good guess. Six, six pounds. Six pounds? Six point, six point nine. Oh, really? Wow. Six point nine. Oh, right, sorry, six point eight three. Six point eight three. There you six point eight three. It's gonna be a good day. Let's let it go. See you, girl. Off she goes. That's all. Oh, yeah, pound it. Pump from my <laughs> double. <laughs> well, this morning started off pretty well. Definitely a lot better than yesterday. I'm not going to put down the Senko guys, that's been the bait that's been uh, crushing them. The bad news is I only have a uh, couple Senkos left and I have to use this crazy color right here. What I'm doing is uh, just using on a little 8th ounce weight, Texas rigged, and uh, these two guys are hitting it shallow and I'm casting just out deep, dragging along the bottom. Felt the tick from that uh, almost 7 pounder. I think it's decent. Oh, no, okay. No, my, my Senko's, gone. Senko's gone. Dang, that hook went through the side into his uh, upper lip. Been having a good morning out here so far. This is like fish number 10 to 15, I'd say. All little ones, one to two pounds, and that one big one happened to show up. So I don't know if you guys noticed this, but uh, we weren't using our rods. We left them in the wrong boat. Got them. The uh, nice mess here. <laughs> All right. <laughs> now we got our gear back. <laughs> now we're gonna catch the biggins. Yeah. Does he already have a fish? Oh, he's got a fish already? Yeah. Just moved to a new spot. <laughs> nice. That's a nice one. Yeah, that's a nice one. On the Senko? On the Senko. Senko. Takes a rig. Got him? Got him? Oh! The true is jacking him. It's like, wait. I think he's caught like 12 or 15, then we've caught like five. That's a good one right there. A brush hog? Brush hog? Brush hog. Very nice. Woo! Nice jump. Good stuff, man. Thank you. We're gonna give these bushes a break over here, and we're gonna go to the real flipping and pitching target. What is that, electric post? Yeah. Electric post right here, this is where the 10 pounders live? I think so. You think so? I hope so. <laughs> no fish in the electric post. Where are we heading now? Let's go to another creek. Another creek, all right. It's similar to the tortugas. 
Okay, let's try it. Let's try it. Let's do it. Does not even matter. Yeah. That nah, little guy. First fish in a little while. A little dink. All right, little buddy. We'll see you in 10 years. Is it the first fish in like two hours? Uh, no. nah. Small one. Sure you got another little small one? And we're both using kind of, well, he's using a different bait, but we both got the uh, special rattle rig that uh, he showed me. Flipping these bushes in 15 feet of water. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, it's a giant. Oh, yeah. Oh, whoa. I got you. I got you. Hold on. Wrapped around. Well, that's how you lose a good fish. At least you didn't, hey, at least you didn't pull a parrot. Well, that sucks. That was a good fish, man. That was. It's all good. It's all good. Well, plenty more bushes for us to fish. Yeah, we're, we're using uh, the crazy rattle rig. So I'm using this lizard here. Then we got these rattles that uh, you can get off special secret that he, <laughs> that he showed me. Then you got a worm weight and a peg. A little extra noise fishing 15 feet of water. Water is very stained. Try to get him, get him to hone in on it a little bit better. Oh, he's in there! He's in there! Oh no, it's a good God! Drop it down, drop it down. It was a good fish. Was it? Drop it, drop it, drop it. That was a big fish. Please get him, please get him. Gosh! He was, he was right in the heart of that. Oh, yeah. Get him, Rob. Fudge! Man. So that last lost fish was my bad. I was not using a super line hook, which uh, you definitely need when. Flipping and pitching heavy cover, you can see if you put a decent amount of pressure on this hook, it'll completely bend out like that. Do not use this in heavy cover. Rookie error. Bob, you say there's more tacos? Yep. Might take a quick taco. Might take a taco break. A little taco break. Oh, nice. Oh, what? Did you have fish? After the taco break? After the taco break. Taco break. Nice, that's a solid fish. Oh, down there getting tacos. <laughs> oh. oh, good release, good release. Um, all right, well, that's about as fast as you can release a fish. Good uh, stuff. You want taco? At least, you, at least we got tacos now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at all those. We got a lot of tacos, man. Good stuff. Yeah, I guess I'll take a baby brush over too. We need a couple yeah. of tacos that we can get back and uh, catch a 10 pounder. Come on, one more big fish. We've been biteless for like an hour. Just trying to cover this sea of freaking trees everywhere, but we're trying to stay near the main channel, right? Yeah. That's key near the drop off. That's where uh, hopefully these fish are hanging out. A lot of dinks, only one good fish today. Hopefully, we get another big one. Oh, nice hook set. Big one? Big one? Oh, nice fish. Ooh, Chewy breaks the ice, finally catches a, finally get another solid, whoa, bigger than I thought. That watermelon red baby brush hog. It's a big brush hog. A oh, big brush yeah, hog. Three and a half. Three and a half, easy. Good job, Chewy. Nice fish, nice fish. All right, new spot right here. More brush, different area. Maybe more fish. I'm about to run into this thing, too. Oh yeah, tree. Good save, good save, good save. Oh shit! Oh, <laughs> Dang, dude. That could have been, <laughs> been real bad. You almost took a little dip there. We got plenty of numbers over here. Need one quality fish. It's time to pull out the big guns. You know what that means, Rob? The big worm? Big worm, that's right. Alright, guys, it's time for the El Mucho Grande 16 inch worm. I'm not taking it off until I catch something on it. Tree, think I'll get something? I don't know. <laughs> it's so big. Come on, man. Look at this thing. 10 pounder is going to eat it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's go. Let's see how it is. Dude, that's a freaking snake in the water. Look at that thing. Holy mackerel. I'm going for the 20 pounder. Forget the 10 pounder. Holy jeez. That's a big boy right there. 
<laughs> it's not. <laughs> Whoa, jeez. Yeah, that scared me. <laughs> <laughs> that was right at the boat, wasn't it? Man, Chewy was killing it up there today. <laughs> nice fish, Chewy. Well, Chewy with another good one. Chewy, you were wrecking house today, dude. Hey, let me know if you want one of the uh, El Mucho Grande worms. You get tired of those fish. <laughs> look at the other oh, look, there's the, uh, what is that? Is a shad in it? Oh, no, there's a shad in there. Huh. Well, nice. Good fish, man. Very fat. Yeah, well, because they're shad in there. All right, well, they're eating shad. Maybe I need to switch to a swim bait. What do you think? Yeah. Maybe swim bait? All right, I just dropped my reel covers. Yeah. Got them. Woo. That could have been bad. We are at our final spot for the day, the spot where Rob caught an eight yesterday, Chewy caught a nine and a half. Time to pull out the big guns, but not too big. I'm putting away the 16 inch worm. I'm downsizing to the man's 12 inch jelly worm, much more appropriate. And I think it'll be good for about a 10 to 12 pounder. Is it a fish? Oh, that's a fish. Oh yeah, it's a good fish, man. Ooh. Oh my god. Let's go, dude. There we go. <laughs> I think she's a little shorter than me, but she's fat. This would be a good tournament fish. Oh yeah. That's under your slot that you need, huh? What do you think it's here in Mexico his, he has to be under 21 inches. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's oh he's only 19 inches. Yeah, that's why she's fat though. There we go. Here you go. Woo! Little right. splash, say goodbye. Yeah, oh, show! Woo! We're good. We're good. That was another one right there. <laughs> oh my god. You caught me off way off guard. <laughs> I was about to tell you something. <laughs> oh, you almost fell in. <laughs> Holy moly. That's called, the, that's called the mean hook set right there. <laughs> <laughs> Calling the day at this lake right here, outro number five, because I always try to. You that fish? That's not a fish. I always forget the name of this lake, so I'm not even going to bother. But I'd like to give it a big thanks. To Chewy Morales for showing me around. Really appreciate it, man. Thank you. Man. Learned a lot from you. Learned how to dissect this vast sea of timber, which uh, must be pretty overwhelming, right? Trying to fish all this stuff. Yeah. Takes years of experience. Learned a lot from. So my GoPro battery just died at the end of the perfect outro take. I'm not going to redo it. I was just going to say I will be back here to catch a 10-pounder, and I'm going to get it on the 16-inch worm. Picture. Hi guys, we're heading back. Ooh. That doesn't look too... Is this a, that, oh my gosh. Did it just happen? That's, oh, it's yep. right in the bottom. It just happened, huh? Yep. You want to... Uh, you want to... I don't know. Let, let it hang. <laughs> let it hang. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, I'm not a watch. That hurt? <laughs> is, it good? is it in there pretty far? So like who casted it? Like, who casted it? Can you... Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh, oh, is that coming out? Past the barb, isn't it? You know, you know the the yeah, trick. You're right you're right yeah. Yes. But you, you know, you know how how it works. The, no, the, oh, I can try, but I can't say that I know how to do it 100%. Just pop it. Oh, you got it. Yes. Woo! Nice job, man. Good. All right, let's do it. It's gonna be. Oye, no lo grabé, güey. Lo puedo hacer.